Yo yeah, boys, what's going on? Welcome back. Episode 37, Docs to Glory. Man, tough run of form for Docs FC. Uh, just one win in our last four Premier League games. We are clinging on to a top four place, but starting today's episode off is the big one. FA Cup, last 16. We're here again, fourth time in five years. Never got to the quarters. And if we're going to do it this year, we've got to take out Manchester City. So bring them on to the basketball pitch. Right, let's jump into it. Loads of games today. Starting with potentially one of the biggest of the save. Man City, last 16 FA Cup. Is this the year we finally reach the quarterfinals? Or will we once again come up short? I, I think we all know the answer, but let's find out anyway. Obviously, when the tie was drawn, I was, you know, very concerned. But to be fair, even though we've had a poor run of form... We've got a semi-tired squad, hence all the changes for the game tonight. We've stood up to Man City pretty well in this save, in the games we've had against them. So, you know, it's it's still possible. Like, well, don't get me wrong, we, we were underdogs, obviously. But it's still possible we could pull off a shock here. Dalton? Over. Key, I think, really is... Fuck. You know what I was just going to say? Not make individual errors and unforced ones. Ah, oh, it's going to be one. Foden. Plays Dawn 2 with Musiala. And it's bottom corner. That was the key. And I've given them that goal cheaply 15 minutes in. God damn. Alright, okay. Time to regroup. Early goal conceded. It's alright. It's okay. Plenty of game to go. Yelovich! Oh! I tried to bend it with the left and he went with the right. It's so frustrating when you try and shape up to shoot with their stronger foot and they go with a weaker one. It's like, why? You better on that foot. Shoot with it. Oh, no, no, no. Oh! He was on there, Haaland. Clipped the post. And goes wide. Man, there's definitely more goals in this game tonight. I'll be stunned if it finishes 1-0. Chances galore for both teams. It's such an open game. Corner, Docs FC. Eight minutes to go before the break, and Wisdom's going to take it. Now, normally, he's got a good connection with Pat from Corners. No, oh, it's off the line. Herrera. Haaland. Mendes. How is it still 1-0? At what point do I just accept fate? Not right now! Ah, oh, finally! Pat smashes it in, it's 1 1! Right, made a few changes. I'm taking off three of my starters, including Kovacavich in the back line. That's the biggest change, I feel. I'm trying to deal with Haaland. I, I do this quite often. If I conceded, I don't mind changing the back line. If I've still kept hold of a clean sheet, I'll keep the back line as it is, you know? I don't know why I do that. I just psychologically, I feel like if they conceded once to that climb, what will stop them doing it again? If you freshen up, maybe that might help. Someone in the middle. Oh yes! One of the changes works. Bowman. Oh, get in! Get over top. You get yes. Oh, that's a foul. Rare foul. Oh, come on. That had to be a foul, because I said so. No. 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 No! You know, as much as we love Mendes, I'm not going to lie here. That should have been stopped. I don't know how on earth that went in. It wasn't powerful. It wasn't right in the corner. That should have been saved. Extra time. How much do you want to bet his pens and we suffer the heartbreak on the spot kicks again? Pat still carrying a knock, so he's not going to run that off. I think it will just be a bruise, to be fair. But um, oh, that's such a shame because he's, he's literally ran that Man City back line ragged all game long. Got the first, set up the second. And now at least, at the very least, a five day injury to see a Mr. Weekend game. And oh no...
I I can't do it anymore. I really can't. Mate, this is heartbreak. Absolute heartbreak. Game. Tie. I, I can't do it anymore, man. I really can't. One win in five in all competitions. And for the fourth year in five, we are knocked out in the last 16. We were seconds away from reaching the quarters. Absolutely heartbroken. How much do you want to bet in the next round we would get the posh Blackburn or Sheffield United if we made it through? I'll check the pad injury right now. I'm pretty sure it's a yeah, five-day injury to Bruce. He was able to soldier on, so I thought it would be. But that FA Cup quarterfinal will put Man City against Blackburn at home. So I reckon we would have taken them. We would have gone to Wembley as well. That just makes it even worse. Screw it. Put it to the back of your mind. It's over. Just focus on what you can control moving forward now. Poor run of form. Let's sort it out now. Staying at home. Southampton. Premier League, 11 games to go, and we're still in the top four. If we can qualify for the Champions League, I won't mind one bit about an FA Cup heartbreak, man. And destiny's in our own hands. Let's get it done. Oh, how is that a foul, ref? How is that a foul? And, oh, James Ward, Prowse. No. No, this is going top bins. Oh, he's on the bar. And Franco gets it away. Man, we survive until the break. Right, I made a position change at the break. Lancaster's now going to play up top. And I've got Bowman on the left and King on the right. Uh, King's got a five-star weak foot, so going onto that right side shouldn't be a problem for him. But Lancaster is now better on the wing. If you remember the start of the season, when I did move him back to striker, he was really good there. So in a game where I've had basically nothing going on at all, I'm hoping this position change might come good for me. Oh, what a touch. And right on cue! <gasps> come on! Bowman in that first half, just rubbish up top, man. But Reggie, Reggie's more of a physical striker. And that's what he can do when he's up top and not on the flank. I, st I still maintain he's better on the flank. Despite the fact most of his goals this year, the vast majority have come as a striker. Even so, great touch by Bowman as well. And there is the lead. We cannot afford to slip up in this game, man. Any... Any chance of us finishing in the top four hinges us on winning these bankers. What a change at the break. Flashbacks to Wednesday night here. Oh, what a ball. Okay, all right. It's okay. We're still in front. Clean sheet goes, but the three points stay. Okay, all right. We'll have it. Back to winning ways. Not what you'd call convincing. Needed a tactical change to do it for us. We've got it. So I've just seen that Bournemouth won the Carabao Cup. So I think that actually means now that it's top six to a European place. It's not top seven. Man... <laughs> If we're going to do this, we're going to do this the hard way. Right, following game, staying at home, Wolves. I haven't had back-to-back -back wins since January. And we really need it if we are to stay in the top four. Come on. Got Pat back for this game as well, so that's a relief. Reggie, to be fair, did well when switching a striker at the break. Oh, at the break in the last one. I tell you what, I could have been a red death, Pedro. That was a terrible tackle. Anyway, man. I don't know if I can do this, man. I really don't. Like I said, I don't really mind if it's not a top four. Oh, Lopez. Just Europe of any kind. Just can't throw that away. There we go, boys. Here we go. Reggie. To Pat. Now back to Reggie out wide. This dude is so physical, man. Oh, he's got it! Well, after the Man City game, I felt we needed a bit of luck, and we've got it. No way does Lopez claim that. It's definitely an own goal, but we'll have it. Well, I thought that came off Lucas Kosterman, but actually it's being credited as a Jordan Pickford own goal. But listen, I don't mind who has to claim it. It's a goal. It's all that matters to me. And Reggie's on there. He's tying that perfectly. This is going to be two. Ah, oh, what an interception. Got 
Reggie. Oh, unlucky, mate. Oh, no, no, no. Watch that man in the middle. Oh, what a rocket. How tight it is right now. Even, even Wolves did have a shot at a European place. This is so hard. If Liverpool win and we fail to match their result, they will leapfrog us and we'll drop out of the top four. They're at home to Burnley, so obviously that's a banker. But, uh, oh, and speaking of, right on cue. Well, okay, all right. Company, there's still a whole half to play. But we've got to do our job anyway. So I'm just going to keep it calm. Oh, Kimura's gone down now. Oh, for fuck's sake. No, Utah! No! So I like this area DM alongside striker. So that is just typical, isn't it? Our first two injuries today. Striker and DM. I mean, perhaps might have been a bruise, but that's an ACL for Kimura, man. No doubt about it. I'll be stunned if that's not an ACL. And, and we're so light at DM. Kimura's class. That's a massive blow. If we're going to do this, we have to do this the hard way and then some. King. Pats. Game, surely. Kimura died for this. <laughs> come on. Obviously, due to how tight it is, it might well come down to goal difference, so... You know, if we can win games by multiple, not just a one, then that would be really important. Well, the Desmond's done brilliantly there. Oh, what a ball, Lopez. And Pat finishes for, I think, his hat trick. It's four regardless, and it's game now for sure. No, sorry, it was Wisdom that got the goal, wasn't it, to put us back in front. Anyway, second for Pat, and that is game now, no doubt about it. Kimura died for this. <laughs> Kimura had to be sacrificed to the gods for this. And this will be Pat's hat trick. Oh, yeah. Like I said, it might come down to goal difference. So this is going to be a big win. Can you leave me a comment, guys, please? Kimura died for this. Or RIP Kimura. One of the two. Because he, he sacrificed himself for this. A true Japanese hero. The Kamikaze mission. It paid off. Yeah, Liverpool won in the end, 4-3, gutted, but it does mean our goal difference gets extended, and because of how tight it is, it might well come down to that. Well, it's not an ACL, but it is a season ender, so I mean, you know, at least he won't miss the start of next season, but I, I don't think he'll be able to recover in time for any more games this year. Kimura the Kamikaze. Appreciate your sacrifice, bro. It helped big time. We love you, mate. Right, might make this one my final game today. West Ham away at the London Stadium. We have jumped into third, but the Red Devils do have a game in hand. Fortunately, though, it comes against Spurs, who are in second. So, yeah, that's a big luxury, knowing that one of those teams is going to drop points there, if not both. Anyway, final game, West Ham. They give it a third straight win in a row. Let's see if we can get it and close out the episode with a big three points. Nobody's really slipping up at the moment. It's just a... Uh... It's just a case of who holds their nerve in the final running. And obviously with no Kimura, that, that, that's a big blow that. Like Kimura, what he does, you don't see on the stat sheet. Do you know what I mean? He's one of those players who does the dirty work. And this guy is the one who does the finishing work. Pat going for the golden boot. Docs FC going for three straight wins. There we go, Lopez. OG. Oh, it's a turn. My whiz. Oh, it's brilliant. Oh, lovely ball out wide. Reggie! That's a brilliant goal, that. That is a brilliant goal. Reggie Ancaster. What time it is? Dagger time. 2 0. So, scores on the door at the break. Spurs are in front against the Red Devils. And again, I would prefer that result there. So, hopefully. Conte side can hold on. And Chelsea play Liverpool later. So hopefully the Blues can do us a favour there. As this game is done. This game is done. Wisdom will wrap it up. It is game. And not only a win, but a win by a few goals as well. Kamura died for this. Yes. Oh, ref. How was that? <laughs> In what way?
fouled his hand or foul referee. He just want to eat whistle or something, mate. Honestly. How is that not a foul? Are you serious? That's your, he just got completely floored. Try disallowing that one, mate. For, how is that not a foul? Serious. I can't believe he allowed play on there. Come on, keep the clean sheet for Mendes. Yes, come on, okay, bitch. Well in. Nah. It's going to do it. We might. If we're lucky, get a fifth. Ah, oh, when the ref's not going to let us. <sighs> Fine by me. How'd you get up from an all-time low? That loss to Man City. How about three straight wins and cementing the top four place for now? Big, big, big response to that buzzing. Right, boys, that's it. Big thank you for watching today's episode of Jocks to Glory. If you enjoyed them, please do drop a like. Can you please leave a comment as well if you watched all the way through with R.I.P. Kimura or Kimura died for this or successful kamikaze mission? One of the three. I want to see how many of you watched till the end. But thank you so much for watching regardless. If you enjoyed them, please drop a like. Much love to you. I have a fantastic day. And I'll see you with another episode of Season 5 as we try and wrap up a top four place. Oh, man, the pressure. Very soon. <laughs>